The Lockheed D-21 drone was developed as an ahead-of-its-time remotely piloted aircraft. It could carry out reconnaissance missions over enemy territory at high altitudes and at high speed. It used technology from both the A-12 and SR-71, but had a ramjet instead of the turbojet engines of the Blackbird. The plane was mostly built with titanium monocoque and a few plastic components. It had a wingspan of 19 feet 9 inches and a body length of 42 feet 10 inches. The D-21 could fly at an altitude of 80 to 95,000 feet, with a speed of Mach 3.32, or 2200 plus miles per hour. The drone carried just one high-resolution camera. However, to launch, the drone needed a mothership because of the ramjet engine, which required sufficient speed in order to function. Initially, a modified A-12 called M-12 was used for this purpose. The D-21 drone would take off from the mothership and fly a pre-programmed route while filming. Afterward, it would release the camera module for retrieval from the air or water, and then self-destruct to prevent enemies from reverse-engineering the technology. Naval ships would be positioned to retrieve the camera module from the water in case the Air Force aircraft failed to retrieve it from the air. Testing The D-21 was first tested thrice from the M-21 Blackbird. These tests all went fantastically, showing real promise. Unfortunately, the fourth try was haunted by the drone experiencing an asymmetric start as it went through the bow wake of the M-21. As a result, the drone crashed into its mothership mid-air. The crash happened at the incredibly high speed of Mach 3.25, and although both pilots were able to escape, one of them was lost at sea. 